back, everyone, to Threads of Fate. So, in the last part, we got uh, Mint's Origins. I showed off Corona Forest, more so to show Mint off. So, pretty much like with Rue's playthrough, the next dungeon we're going to be going to is the Underground Ruins. So, as I said, I will be showing off um, story segments, you know, so... Even though, you know, it's damn near identical to, you know, what we had with Ruse playthrough, I'm still going to show off story segments, so I do apologize for that type of repetition. But as far as going through dungeons, I will be cutting through a lot of the underground ruins. Like, more so just to show off, like, any, any specific stuff for Mint. But while they're, while they're farting around, yeah, how are you guys? can't stop staring at Mint's rings. They're like clipping through each other and it's weird. <laughs> okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Play PlayStation 1. Oh, well. I mean, it's like, you can even see, like, Mint's hair, like, clipping through, like, her shoulders. Oh, yeah. I get that much. That said, I can't help but laugh, because you mentioned how the last part... That, you know, pretty much Mint goes through the exact same kind of story that Rue does. I'm gonna be honest, don't remember pretty much any of Rue's story. Right. All I remember yeah, is that, all I really remember is that I just don't like Rue. I just, I don't even remember why, honestly. I think it, yeah, with Rue, if I recall correctly, it was just more so, like, he was very predictable. Like, I know it really bugged you when we got to the part where, uh, we ran into Mode Master, and she disguised herself as Claire, and he like complete, yeah. and she did she did this several times, and each time that she did it, like he would go to try and attack her, and then she transforms into Claire, and he stops. Oh like, yeah. Even, yeah, 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 even, yeah, well, yeah, which was really fucking stupid. He goes, it's like Ruse saw Mode Master like transform into Claire once. So you would think at that point, Rue would learn his lesson. It's like, oh wait, hold up. That's not the real Claire. That's just Mode Master trying to screw with me. Okay, now now that shouldn't affect me anymore. I should go ahead and attack Mode Master. But no, even at the second, third, fourth, tenth time, <laughs> literally yeah. every time Mode Master transforms into Claire, even after the first time, Rue still, like, hesitates and, or just doesn't attack. It's like, no, no, I can't attack Claire, no. Yeah. Fuck Rue. Yeah. I don't yeah. I'm 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 right I'm right there with you, Mint. I don't remember who he is either. Yeah, it's like again, it doesn't matter which option you pick, so I just opted for the funnier one. But it's like um but yeah, so um pretty much after that exchange, uh Klaus gave us uh red magic. So now we have fire magic. So we will be using um fire magic in um in the underground ruins. Now, um, I believe I said this in the last video, but uh, what, I, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be showing off, like, the first uh, screen of each dungeon. You know, it provided that there's nothing unique to collect or anything. So, pretty much after we go through, like, the first screen, you know, then we're going to be fast-forwarding. It's like, oh, all of a sudden we're halfway through the dungeon. But yeah, that's just more or less... Yeah, story-wise, Rue is just saying, you know, it's dangerous to go alone. I'm gonna go with you, and you know, going Mint. First. Yeah, and then, yeah, Mint. My plan to monopolize the treasure is ruined. She's like, she wanted everything for herself, but now that Rue's come along, she's like, fuck. Now I gotta split shit with him. No, you don't. <laughs> you like, use him to get yeah, there. Yeah, the treasure, burn him. Use him to get there, and then and, and then and then knock him out once you once you find it. Yeah, you know, you, know how you, you know how you kick kick those goons, like, straight in the face or something? Yeah, do that to Rue. Like, when he's not paying attention. Flame fillers. Bubbles! 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 <laughs> yeah, it's like, yeah, we're going Caesar Zeppeli all up in here now. Yeah, because, uh, the, bubble, the bubbles oh, actually... Oh, damn it. <laughs> yeah, the bubbles, the, like, bubbles. Because, you know, a lot of the monsters, actually the majority of the monsters here, they are based off of fire, which is kind of weird. Like, you would think that, you know, oh, we just got fire magic. We should probably use it. And yet, like, the salamanders are strong against it. 
the fire magic is just kind of average. So you're gonna just want to actually abuse the bubbles. The bubbles do a lot of damage here. Fucking hell. Bubble cutter! God damn it. I mean, he had to go first. Right. I, w I went around those uh, fire salamanders. Ha, ah, get fucked, oh, asshole. Ru is dead. He's so dead. But who cares that? Well, that was odd, that was oddly dead. yeah that was oddly comedic for Rue. Huh? Hey yeah. yo, Rue. You all right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He'll be fine. Come <laughs> oh wait, he actually does. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> you devil! God damn it! <laughs> You I was did. joking. <laughs> again, you this devil. goes again. This goes into you know the whole uh, predictability issue that you had with him because <laughs> every other word that came out of Rue's mouth was fucking Claire. <laughs> uh, Maria, you, you devil, <laughs> Maria. <laughs> yeah, I mean it's exactly it's exactly like Shadow. <laughs> Maria, God damn it. God damn it. That's I hate so everything. <laughs> the timing of that was perfect. Oh. I'm upset now. <laughs> oh, hey, it's the, um, the Ryu Kaiser. Yes. R Ryu Kishin. Yeah. Still as ineffective as the card itself. Yeah. <laughs> It's like 1,600 attack points. push <laughs> You know I meant has 1,500. Fuck! Stop, damn it! <laughs> I need to use block attack. Oh, well, or you know, just fall, or just, you know, trap pull. That works too, I guess. I play stop attack. Stop attack? No, you, you mean block attack. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't, and that's a, like, I'm, I'm sure there probably is, if there is, I never heard, I don't think there's a card called Stop Attack, I know there's the card Block Attack, which yeah, forces that, that, that's you. Yeah, that's probably what I was thinking of. Yeah, because that's the card that, there's, there's... Yeah, that, that's the card that forces you into defense mode if you're in attack mode. Yeah, yeah, as opposed to, yeah, I, I don't, I know the, yeah, then there was, yeah, then there was Stop Defense, which does the exact opposite. That, that, I probably, I probably, like, somehow, like, mixed, mixed up, like, the, like the names of both of those cards together. Something. I don't know. Block defense. Wait. It's like yeah, well, blocking your defense, yeah, ain't gonna do shit. <laughs> no, yeah, uh, not to mince mighty actually, foot. Hold on a second. I think it actually may be stop defense. Actually, it's block attack and stop defense. Let me see. Let yeah, me yeah, check that, on that yeah, one. yeah, 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 that, yeah. That's what I was saying. There's stop defense, and then there was, and then there was block attack, like what you said. Let me check, hold on. <laughs> oh, Open up like, Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links am, here. Oh no, god, it's like, I am like, so out of touch with the card game. But, but, but yeah, it's like, no, 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 that, that would be, be a rather weird card, it's like, block defense, it's like, oh, so... You're blocking. You're, so, 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 you're a fake, so a card that is like, putting more emphasis on defending, oh, okay, alright. I play the redundant redundancy magic card. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Stop. Yeah, there's stop defense, which is yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, turn yeah, move turn one defense pushing monster into attack mode. And then Yeah, block yeah, attack. So yeah, it's it's block attack and stop defense. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So 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 yeah, yeah, you were right. Again, I guess I I guess I just been like been a while since I've played like anything with you know, later. I guess I got the two names mixed up at first. Of course, we couldn't just make our lives easier entirely and ju just use shield and sword. But again, that, how, that much how much how much defense how much defense does Mint have? Because if she has fifteen hundred attack, what's her defense? Uh, I would say less than that. Less than. That. Yeah, I I would say so just because I mean again I'm thinking back to you know because Roost play style is all about you know. 
you know, high hit points and high attack, whereas like Mint is all about the MP. Okay, because Ryo Kishin power, it has 1600 attack and 1200 defense. So if you use stop and shield on it, that'd make its attack, it, it, it's attack weaker. But if Mint has lower defense than th 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 Ryo Kishin power, then that's not going to mean anything. So yeah, let's just, let's just go with block attack. Wait, the fuck? What? What? Okay, 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 okay. Never, never mind, never mind. <laughs> okay. It, it was just something. It was just like, uh, fucking, <laughs> like the whole attack power with the shit power, and then you met, keep mentioning the original Ryuki shit. I'm like, wait, hold on. Well, no, the monster we just fought looks like Ryuki shit power specifically. Yeah, which has 1600 attack power. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, sh oh, okay. I completely forgot there was such thing as Ryukishin Clown. Oh, huh. yeah, that is a thing, isn't it? Yes. Oh, well. Hey, we got, we got a fancy tiara. <laughs> it's like. Oh, God. It's God damn it. Hold on. Is there, a, is there an equip spell card that's based off the tiara? Let me check. <laughs> I'm sure there I, is. I, I, yeah, I, I wouldn't be surprised. If there is one, I don't have. I don't. I don't currently have it in Dual Links, but are, is there at least a crown? But how many fucking magic cards are there? There's gotta be at least one. There's not. All right, hold on. I I'm just checking through Dual Links. Let me check online specifically. Okay. And we just picked up a cube, so I. I'm pretty sure there's a cube. But I. I just love this little bit here. So she steps on. Nothing's happening. Fuck you, puzzle. <laughs> it's like, I don't know why. That, that just makes me smile. Where it's like, it doesn't work, so what does she do? She stamps on it. Oh my god, the blue winged crown. Oh, wait. Hey, and hey, we got Team Rocket here. Jesse and James, exactly. Alright, so. Now, uh, if you remember during Rue's playthrough, I was singing these two's praises, even though they were barely in Rue's story. The reason I sing their praises, they are heavy in Mint's story. So be prepared to see a lot of Duke and Bell in this playthrough. Okay. And yeah, while it's never really explained how and when, but yeah, uh, Bell and Mint have crossed paths before. So, I guess that's where it's like, you know, I guess you could say where it's like, you know, Duke and... Fuck you, phone. So, whereas... <laughs> uh, random, random solicitor. So, uh, whereas uh, Rue and Duke were the rivals, so naturally, of course, this means Mint and Belle are the rivals. Hmm. Oh... Damn. It's like, yeah, my lady's only 30 if you round down. <laughs> So, you round, if you round down from... <laughs> yeah, so that's like, so what? So you're saying Belle is my age and I'm considered old? That's like, fuck! I'm screwed! <laughs> oh god. That also said, there... apparently there is no spell card that are based off of tiaras or crowns, surprisingly enough. There is oh. a monster called, there is a monster called the, uh, the mat, the, 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 uh, the mad Ulch Queen Tiara Misu, which is an exceed monster. And then there's also blue winged crowns, which are birds, not crowns. So I guess, okay. Huh. Huh. Yeah, I, I well, it's so, it's interesting because um, it's like uh, apparently it's like I, I I don't know if it's like a Japanese exclusive card or whatever, but I, I just found this thing called the XYZ crown, or I, I guess it's translated the XYZ jewel crown. Oh, XY, it's probably it's it's ex the exceed, exceeds. Oh, is it? I don't know why they're spelt like that. It's dumb. I don't like them. Huh. Which is why I really like Duel Links, because right now, as of right now, Duel Links is keeping ev it's keeping everything simple. You know, it's so far it's, it's going as far as GX, so no synchros, no exceeds, no whatever that last one was. I don't like either. Uh, pendul uh, the, the pendulum summoning. Yeah, that, that, that that, yeah, that's not gonna last. You do realize this. I know, but let me enjoy it while it does last. <laughs> Yeah, because, like, as soon as they bring in 5Ds, then it's like everybody is going to go all synchro. 
And then you know what? I even then, because the game is set up in a way, um, so that because the game actually is set up um, to keep the the generations separated, like you can you can fight the other generations if you want to, but also but you but you do have the option not to. So even when 5Ds and all that stuff comes in, I can still keep it with you know with, with the format that I like. Okay. So that's that's what's pretty cool about Duel Links. Unless they fuck it up, in which case I'll just delete the game out of my phone right there and then. But <laughs> that's you know that's you know they add 5Ds into the mix, and then it's like okay, it is required for you to play Duel Links on your phone while also riding on a motorcycle. I still got fire. I, I still got Fire Emblem Heroes. I'm good. I'm good on my. I'm good on my mobile phone kicks. <laughs> also get fucked. <laughs> Surprise! Surprise! It's amazing how she did just fall off the ledge, considering how half of her body was yeah. like, like off the platform. Just, just like if you were to kill an elite near the edge, and Halo Combat evolved. Oh, but yeah, Jesse, so... I'm too tired. Yeah, so yeah, yeah, he missed the entire fight. <laughs> you think in the amount of time it took it, it, it took for her to get Duke to get Duke off the ground, she would have walked up there and kicked your ass again. <laughs> right. At this part, I remember that said, "Round two against Ryu Kishin powered." Yeah. Yep, so just as last time, you know, we do gotta face him off again, but uh, all you gotta do is hit, make sure you hit him once, and then just continue onward. Fuck! <laughs> how many times, <laughs> god damn it, how many times, how many times is, is this asshole gonna use trap hole? God! Yeah, fuck you. Yep, love so, me! Love yep, me! Yep, so just like last time, hug the end, hug the inner end, and just just keep going up, be mindful of the spike balls. So what, what would happen if you killed him before going up here? Like, would he still follow you? I think it's, a, I think second time around, it's actually impossible to kill him. Huh. I mean, they deliberately made it that way just so that we can have this secret. I see he equipped one of those cards that makes it impossible to be destroyed by a battle. I forget what it's called. <laughs> or if there's even a card that can be equipped to a, mo to a, to a monster if it's, if it's attack power. I think there is. So I guess, uh, defeated by card effect, uh, Deus Ex Machina? I guess? <laughs> Cause it's like, cause it's like, yeah, okay, Ru, you were squished under a boulder, and now it's like, oh, now you're, now you're alive, you're okay, and you're back at full power. No, no, Ru is what we call Dark Hole because he's like Shadow, and Shadow's black, and black is dark, and I'm just stretching it now. <laughs> yeah. Oh you're no, you know, you know, you know what? Ru, it, Ru, Ru, Ru's story left a hole in my heart. There you go. No. <laughs> You could you could say he's had a change of heart. That card is banned. <laughs> then again, also, so I, th also, I think so. Ru is was banned. I, Yay! Actually, actually, I think so is Dark Hole though. So yeah, but, yeah no matter what, Rue is banned. Fuck, fuck Rue. <laughs> <laughs> is oh, Dark Hole still banned? I don't actually remember. Oh well. I remember Dark Hole being one of those cards that had one of those cards that, where like I had like a thousand copies of it. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> yes. I still remember back when like the like getting your hands on the the three Egyptian god cards were like all the rage. Also, they keep talking about a cube. Is this is this Dungeon Dice Monsters? Ha <laughs> ha 
<laughs> Don't worry, guys. We're getting to a we're getting to a Yu-Gi-Oh game soon. I promise. <laughs> then we'll get it all out of our systems then. God fucking damn it, BJ! <laughs> the fucking dungeon dice monsters. You know the other game that they tried to get off the ground and it never did. <laughs> was that ever even incorporated in, into a real life game, or was that only in the show? I think I think they tried to, because I remember seeing like some like figures or something. I think they tried to, but it nah, it didn't go anywhere. I mean, that's like I don't even. It's like it's like you would think if anything, there'd maybe be at least like one video game. But if there, I like I don't recall if there's even a video game of it. And if there was one, it was probably shit because it, you know, not like that flew around anywhere. Hell, you know what? Dungeon Dice Monsters was so was, was, was such a bad idea on their end. They don't even want to put Duke Devlin into anything. What the fuck? That character was- I, I'm pretty sure I ranted about this before, but that character was such a prominent character in the show. And all of the games seem to forget that he exists. They they yeah. prioritize Esperoba over, over Duke Devlin most of the time. And Esperoba was only, was only in one fucking episode. Yeah. And it's like, it's a real damn shame. Like, you know, I know Yu-Gi-Oh! had its amount of filler and everything, so... But even with that, yeah, he was a prominent character. And I mean, even in the manga... Now, granted, like, the way they handled the Dungeon Dice Monster storyline in the manga was, uh, different from what they did in the show, like, in the anime adaptation. Like, they decided to cut it apart in the anime adaptation, and I don't understand why, because it's like, you know, yeah, like, his character in the manga is actually really damn interesting, and we don't get any of that in the anime adaptation, and it sucks. Hell, Duke Devlin is even featured on the card Unity, which is the card that shows, like, you know, friendship, which has Yugi, Joey, Tristan, and Taya on it. Duke's on that card, too. So he's, right. he's, he's, a, pro he's a prominent part of the friend circle. He's a prominent part of the friend circle to be a on that card, but the video games seem to forget that he exists. For some reason. Like, all the video games. I don't know a single goddamn video game that he's a part of. Alright, so, um, briefly, before we uh, end off, with Mint... You are going to want to go all the way back to the underground ruins. You're going to want to go down here. You will find, at the bottom of these stairs, you'll find uh, Ryukushin Powered. Uh, you'll find this corpse down at the very bottom. You, with mint only, you're going to want to, you're going to, want to investigate it. Because there, now we have the power effect. Oh, so. how appropriate. So now it's just Ryukushin. Yep, so now we're taking, <laughs> now, we're now we're taking the power effect. We we uh, took the we took the powered version of Ryokishin power. Now it's just Ryokishin. All right. <laughs> yeah, now he's it's like, "Oh, no. Okay, now he went from 1600 attack power to 1000 attack power." Sucks to suck. All righty, so <laughs> oh, um, yep. whatever. All righty, so with that said, uh join us in the next video when we will be blazing through Fancy Mel. Thank you